happy people. Today I am playing around with a new product that I think you'll like a lot. Uh, please excuse my voice. I am getting over a cold and I lost my voice for the past couple of days. Thankfully, some of my video I spoke while I crafted before I got sick, so you won't have to hear this sad voice. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. So I'm starting out with these blocks that I had in my stash and I just painted them with an ivory Waverly chalk paint and then distressed the edges. So I printed out the word welcome on this hippo water slide decal paper. This paper was pretty awesome to use, but the paper was pretty simple. It comes with a set of directions on the back so you use this paper with just your everyday inkjet printer, which is pretty cool. You can pick a picture or print out words and you literally just print it out on the photo paper setting. And after it fully dries, you will seal it with just an acrylic spray paint. And the directions are pretty clear. They literally say to place it on a flat surface and spray with the clear acrylic spray paint and wait 10 minutes and then spray again and you're going to do three coats of that spray paint. Then it tells you to cut out your dry water slide decal with a pair of scissors or a cutting machine and you can just you just leave a border around it of about an eighth of an inch or three millimeters. Okay. Okay, so I'm kind of nervous about you doing this. Dang, I'm kind of nervous. And it's literally a piece of paper. <laughs> okay, here goes nothing. So it says to put the decal in tap water and let it sit for 30 to 60 seconds. Maybe I should get a timer. <laughs> okay, here it goes. Oh my goodness. Ah! Okay. It says to keep it in the water until you can slide it with your finger. So I'm gonna try and attempt to, oh my goodness, hey, that's cool, okay. Oh, is it, I think I understand how this is gonna work. I have been trying to figure out how this is gonna work because I'm, oh, okay. Okay, I think it's gonna work. Let's see. So it says to wet your surface. So I'm gonna wet my surface. Should have cleaned my hands first. I'm working with white here. And then it says, let me zoom in. And then it says to to take off the decal whoa, and put it into position. Slide it into position where I want it. Oh my goodness. And then once it's where you want it, you're supposed to just use a, oh, once it's where you are pleased with it, you just wipe off the excess water with a paper towel. Oh my goodness, if this works, this is genius. Okay, and then it says, so check that out. There's a little bit of a lip here, but even if that's left over, I'll just Mod Podge over it. Okay, so I'm 
Okay, so it says to do that and then let it dry. I think it said for three hours. So in three hours, I'll show you what it looks like. That's cool. Like, I'm not going to lie. That's really cool. What a cool product. Okay, I'm going to do the rest of my tiles or the rest of my cubes. And then I'll show you what I'm going to make with them. It's pretty cool. Wow. All right. Okay, so now I want to make extra stuff like I want to make more because that was really fun So I have these tiles. They're dirty, but I have these tiles that I intended to make coasters Out of but I just never got around to it. So it's just a regular tile that I think I got at Home Depot or something so There you go, I'm going to I printed out some more and I'm going to, I printed out some really cool pictures that I just got off of Google. But aren't they so cute and fall inspired? Look, how cute are these? And I think I just looked up like pumpkin patch or something, pumpkins. Oh, my door's gonna slam. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Let's try something bigger. I'm excited. I'm gonna try this picture. This is such an easy craft. So if this works, then this is one of the coolest products I've ever used because it's super simple. You just print it out. You're literally just printing it out you're spraying it with acrylic paint, which is just a clear coat, right? A just clear coated paint. And then you let it dry, you dip it in water, and you stick it on the surface, and then let it dry for three hours. That's super cool and simple. I, look at that. Ah, that's gonna be cool. Look at that, oh, I'm excited. I'm so excited, okay. I'm gonna do this. Do I want, the only thing is that this little lip I probably should have paid attention because I think I got the the edge pieces instead of are they all like that. I guess they're all supposed maybe they're all supposed to be like that. I've never I don't I've, clearly I don't know anything about tile, but okay I'm gonna try this. Okay. Ah, I'm nervous again. Okay. Oh, I should probably have more water. Let me add more water. That scares me every time. Why? Okay, it just shrivels up. Just soaking it in the water. It's 
gonna come off okay. Let's do it one more time. Okay. Let's try this again. Let's get this all wet. Okay. Oh my goodness, how cool! Are you seeing this? Dang, look at that. What a cool product. Thank you, Hippo. This is really fun. Check me out. I'm like moving my picture around. Like it's so simple. Look. It's almost... I almost feel like you can't really mess this up. Like I'm really nervous because I thought... I thought it... I might mess up the picture or damage it. And look, I'm... It doesn't even matter. I could do this if I need to. I can move it around. So I can totally reposition if I were to mess up or if I need to get a bubble out or whatever and then oh what did I do with it okay so then when I get it into position that I like then I just take off the excess water Honestly, I was really nervous about even trying out this product because I thought, what if I really suck at it and then I've got nothing to show you and then I disappoint this, like, I disappoint everyone. But, oh, oh man, I wish you guys could see this the way that I see it because I used a matte finish acrylic paint and it looks so nice. It looks so, oh, um, maybe you can kind of see it. I wonder if I open my window. <laughs> like, I don't, this doesn't do any justice. But it's like a matte finish. And this looks gorgeous. Oh my goodness. <sighs> okay. I'm going to set it to dry and I'm going to do the other ones. And then I'll show them to you when I'm done. Oh, I can't get over it. This is so cool. Wow. Really fun. Seriously, I'm I'm not over exaggerating. It takes a lot to wow me, but this is really not what I expected. I expected it to be really complicated. It looked complicated when I was reading the directions, so I was really scared and hesitant. This was simple. I'm sad I waited so long to do it. But I'm doing it now.
you'd like to try out this awesome product for yourself, I will have a link in the description box below. Thank you so much for giving me a moment of your day, and I hope you have a really great one. Bye!